Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. I'm Brian. If you've never been here before, this is my Fluid Art channel. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, today I'm just doing some uh, blooms on some coasters, but I'm not using house paint. I'm using acrylic paints. And the colors that I'm going to be using, I'm not using a pouring medium with them um, like you traditionally would with a bloom. I'm just using my gloss medium and Floetrol. And then I'm going to use my cell activator, which is my Amsterdam paints and um, Australian Floetrol. So um, it, it's not like the traditional bloom. You still get the similar effects to it, but it's not the, it doesn't react the same way. But I'm doing uh, a lot of these coasters because I have my Christmas show that starts in November. So I'm trying to get a lot of these made up. So that's what the video is going to be today. Hope you enjoy it. Let's get down on these uh, tiles and get started. I'll be right back. All right, everyone. So I am going, I'm really, really behind in making my tiles for my, our, uh, for my Christmas show that I do every year. I belong to an arts and crafts association and we rent out a store space and we're able to put all of our art in the store. And so every year I do my, put my paintings in there and I also put my tiles. So I do these uh, hexagon tiles. I do square tiles. I also do little four by four tiles. Um, I do jewelry, like I said, my paintings. So I um, am really, really behind on it. So I'm gonna do some quick little acrylic blowouts. They're not necessarily blooms because I'm not using the bloom uh, materials. This here is just Artist Loft Soft Body White. Spin that around. In essence, it is blooming, but it's not using the same materials for a bloom. All right. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put down this golden Prussian blue. Some fluorescent pink from Pebio. Some metallic cobalt blue. Some more of the Payne's gray, or excuse me, Prussian blue. And just a touch bit more of the pink. I'm going to take my white cell activator and put it on my palette knife here. I'm going to swipe right through the center. let the cell activator do its job. It's going to sell up, create some lacing. So now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to give it a few little ricks and swipes because I want to create some added dimension to this give it a little bit of contrast. Cause if I just spin this out, it's just gonna be one giant cell. Actually, you know what? I'll do that. I'm not gonna wreck this. I'm gonna let it be one giant cell, let them all spread out. Then I'll do another one and we'll see the difference. Go back the other way. that look 
giant, giant cells. That is no silicone whatsoever. That is just the house paint, or excuse me, that is just the Artist Loft soft body white and regular paints. These are paints mixed with Floetrol and uh, gloss pouring medium. That is it. So let's do another one. We're gonna do the exact same colors, same order. And this time I'm going to do some wreckage. Metallic cobalt blue. Some more Prussian. And some more pink. Right here on the edge. That was just on the side of there. I like the way it looked, so I just put it out there. It's gonna get spun off though. Look at the cells that are happening here, looking great. So this one I am gonna wreck, just so we can see a difference in composition. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna do some loop-de-loops. See what this looks like spun out. Let's go back the other way. I like the loops, how they just spread out. This is actually just table scraps of a blue. So this is, you know, just paint, Floetrol, gloss medium. So this here was just a bunch of blues and reds mixed together. So I got a nice deep blue here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use, I'm gonna do it like a chaos ribbon swipe. So this is pyro red. Again, gloss medium, paint, and Floetrol only. And we're going to do some fluorescent pink from Pebeo Studio Acrylic. And we're going to do some Prussian blue from Golden. Again, just gloss medium, Floetrol, and paint. And cell activator is going to be my titanium white and Australian flow drop. And I'm gonna start right here in the center and just go straight through. Lightly pressing. 
right over the edge. That's what I was afraid of. Give it a try again. All right, lightly press. Take it over the edge. All right, I'm gonna go back the other way. Lightly press. All right, let's give it a spin. Wow, cells, cells, cells. That's pretty wild. All right, so here we are with the three that I finished. I did all of these as well, but I didn't put them on camera. But this is the last one that I did. We got this one. And we got this one. And these are the ones I did off camera. That one's cool, I like that a lot. All right, so when these dry, I will let you see them. Hopefully they'll dry by tomorrow. All right guys, I'll be right back. All right guys, so here we are with these two. Really dried great, so they're going to coat of resin. But look at the lines, look at the lacing, look at the cells. And this is done without house paint, without any sort of pouring medium, just regular acrylic paint, Floetrol, and water. All right, and here is the other two. Again, really cool lacing. Wrecking the cells kind of gave it a different definition. Really cool. All right, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. So I have got these resined. And there they are. Hope you can see that. Not too much of a glare. I'm trying to bring that up to you close. But beautiful finish with the resin. So these will, um, I uh, heat up the back and I remove my tape and all the little uh, drips. And then I put my um, cork backing on the back. These are the other two. So there's that one. And that one. So you can still do bloom type techniques with acrylic paints. Now, these pieces are available if you want these. I sell these uh, seven inch octagon pieces or hexagon pieces 
for $25 and I sell my squares for $22. So if you like these, let me know. I'm gonna, like I said, they're gonna get cork backings and then I can send them out to you. All right, everyone, thanks for tuning in. I appreciate you watching and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell. That'll let you know when I do post new video content. Everyone have a great day. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.